Hello YouTube, welcome back to this week's video. This is 2E0 IQJ. So this radio here is a Quansheng UV-K5. In the last week's video, I showed you how to modify the firmware to be able to receive SSB. If you haven't seen that video, go back and watch it. Now with all firmwares that you mod on the radio, they are experimental. But this week's um, video, what I thought I'd show you is another firmware I found, and it was TX on uh, SSB. So we can do two meter sideband, and we can do 70 centimeter sideband. How cool is that? This radio now goes from 18 megs right up to 1.3 gigs and they can TX on sideband. Let's take a closer look. Okay, so we're up in the shack with the Quansheng UVK5 and I flashed it with the firmware, like I said earlier in the video. Don't know how to do that. Go watch this video, I'll show you how to do that. And in the description below, I'll link the firmware that I've added to this radio. The problem I had it was I charged it via USB C when I got it in the morning and I thought, great, the radio's going to be charged. But the LED at the top was just flashing blue and it was only about 80 or 90% charged. So I did charge that via USB-C, maybe I'll try it with the old base charger and see if that makes any difference. And also I'll revert it back to the stock firmware using that web browser and uh, see what it's like charging see if it improves the charging at all. If you have any problems charging it, post it in the comments below. If it just charges up as normal, then also post it in the comments below. So let's turn the radio on. You'll see there we've got an IJV mod. You'll see now the screen looks slightly different than last week's one. You press the menu, you go down to number three, you'll see mode. If I press the mode button, we've got um, FM, AM, and we've also got DSB, which is the sideband. You can just press menu there and exit, and then we're on sideband. So let's give it a test on sideband with the Yaesu radio. Okay, so we're currently shifting there on 144.360, and I've got the Quan Shen tuned to 144. 360, let's give it a key up and test it. Audio check 1234. Audio check 1234. That sounds distorted. Let's see if I can tune it in a bit better. Audio check 1234. Audio check 1234. 1234. Audio check 1234. Let's try it like that one. 2E0 IQJ. 2E0 IQJ. Audio check 1234. So we go the Quansheng UV K5. We did a firmware mod, enables us now to TX on sideband. How cool is that? This radio does 18 megs, right up to 1.3 gigs, and you can do two meters and 70 cents sideband. That's cool for this radio. Now these radios are cheap. I've seen them as low like as 14 quid for just a radio, with no box, no charger, nothing. 14 quid, and you get yourself a 18 megs to 1.3 gigs. Uh, radio there. Now with all firmware they're experimental so do so at your own risk but if you've done the SSB mod for this and you can transmit an SSB how are you getting on with it? You find that it works okay or you've not made any contacts yet? The real test will be at the beginning of the month when they do the two meter sideband contest in the evening. I'll take this out and see if I can hear anyone and see if I can make any contacts. Anyhow if you found the video some news not to do give it a thumbs up. If you don't like the video the other button seems to work too. But as always thank you very much for watching. I'll see you in the next video. This is 2E0 IQJ. 7-3 for now.